one pot instant pot spaghetti. So I like to use ground turkey. You can use ground beef if you'd like. Now I'm just gonna put a little bit of olive oil in the bottom of my instant pot. Turn your instant pot on and push the saute button. Next, I'm just gonna throw in one pound of my ground turkey. And I do a half of an onion. You can do a whole onion if you want, but my family doesn't really like onions, so we do half an onion. Now this is called a chopster. If you've never heard of one, it's amazing when you're cooking ground beef or ground turkey. It just literally chops and stirs it up. <laughs> I got mine on Amazon for like six or seven dollars. I'll do a link in the description for those of you who are looking for one. Now you want your ground turkey or ground beef to be mostly cooked. It's okay if there's a little bit of pink, but mostly cooked. So now you're gonna add a half a pound of spaghetti noodles. So that's half of this box. Now you're gonna break the spaghetti noodles in half and spread them all around the meat. The more spread out they are, the better they will cook. And notice how I did some going one way and some going another way. That makes them cook a little bit better. Next, I'm gonna add one can of diced tomatoes. Now, you don't have to add the tomatoes. I just like a few more chunks in my spaghetti. After the tomatoes, I'm gonna to add one jar of your favorite spaghetti sauce or marinara sauce or whatever you like to put on your spaghetti, just one whole jar. Now, the trick is to cover all of the noodles, so there should be no noodles showing at all. Then put your lid on and make sure that it's on sealing, not venting. You're gonna cook this, gonna turn it on. It was on saute, then you turned it on. Then you're gonna do manual and up to eight minutes. Now because the sauce was thick, I let this release on its own and then I mixed it up. I like to serve my spaghetti with rolls and a, a side salad of some sort.